एच सी वर्मा चैप्टर सेवन क्वेश्चन नंबर एटीन इन द सोल्यूशन टू दिस क्वेश्चन वी विल बी यूजिंग द कॉन्सेप्ट ऑफ एंगल ऑफ फ्रिक्शन इफ यू हैव नॉट ऑलरेडी सीन आवर वीडियो एक्सप्लेनिंग द एंगल ऑफ फ्रिक्शन एंड इट्स एप्लीकेशन इन प्रॉब्लम सोल्विंग इट्स हाईली रिकमेंडेड दट यू सी इट बिफोर वॉचिंग दिस सोल्यूशन द लिंक फॉर द वीडियो इज सोन ऑन द स्क्रीन एंड इज गिवन इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन बिलो अ टर्न ऑफ रेडियस ट्वेंटी मीटर इज बैंक फॉर द वेहीकल्स गोइंग एट स्पीड ऑफ थर्टी सिक्स किलोमीटर पर आवर द कोफिशियंट ऑफ स्टैटिक फ्रिक्शन बिटवीन द रोड एंड द टायर इज जीरो पॉइंट फोर What are the possible speeds of a vehicle so that it neither slips down or skids up? Let us first look at the forces which are trying to move the vehicle with respect to the road. There is a gravitational force acting in vertically downward direction and a centrifugal force mv square by r in horizontal direction. Let F net be the resultant of these two forces. From simple geometry, we know that the gravity will make an angle theta with the direction of normal. From our discussion on angle of friction, we know that the vehicle will start sliding down if F net makes an angle more than tan inverse mu with the normal. Let tan inverse mu be phi. So, in limiting case, F net makes an angle phi with the normal, which means F net makes an angle theta minus phi with the mg. Thus, mv square by r divided by mg must be equal to tan theta minus phi. Which implies v square by r g is equal to tan theta minus tan phi divided by one plus tan theta tan phi, or v square is equal to r g tan theta minus tan phi divided by one plus tan theta tan phi, which implies v is equal to root under r g into tan theta minus tan phi divided by one plus tan theta into tan phi. Since the road is banked for thirty six kilometer per hour or ten meter per second. Tan theta must be equal to v not square by r g, where v not is equal to 10 meter per second. Putting the values of v not, r, and g, we get tan theta is equal to 100 by 200 or 0.5. Putting tan theta as 0.5 and tan phi as mu, that is 0.4, and simplifying, we get v is equal to 4.08 meter per second or 14.7 kilometer per hour. This is the minimum speed vehicle can travel without slipping down. If the speed of the vehicle is increased the centrifugal force will increase increasing the angle that f net makes with the vertical when this angle becomes more than phi on the other side of the normal the vehicle will start skidding up in limiting case f net makes exactly phi with the direction of normal therefore mv square by r divided by mg must be equal to tan theta plus phi or v square by rj is equal to tan theta plus tan phi divided by 1 minus tan theta tan phi Which implies v square is equal to r g tan theta plus tan phi divided by one minus tan theta tan phi, or v is equal to root under r g into tan theta plus tan phi divided by one minus tan theta tan phi. Putting the values of r g tan theta tan phi and simplifying, we get v is equal to fifteen meter per second or fifty four kilometers per hour. This is the maximum speed beyond which the vehicle will start skidding up. In order to request solution to any question from HC Mama book post the question number and chapter number in comments below like and share the video to help other students find us subscribe the channel for further updates thank you for watching